Hey guys, shift click here. Welcome to another episode of Ticket Build. Uh, today I have a wood harvesting machine or a wood chopper. Uh, like the previous one, this is uh, a better version, version 2. Uh, so let's get going. Uh, first things first, we need a uh, plug breaker to play, break the the, uh, the wood blocks. Then we need a couple of deployers. I'm going to grab those. And these are for, of course, for the sapling and the uh, bone meal. So let's throw some saplings in here. And some bone meal in here. And then let's wire them up. So that's the on off switch and I'm going to wire this with a uh, repeater. So first goes the sapling and then the uh, bone meal. And if we flip it, we should get a three. Okay, now let we need to set up the uh, block breaker. And I'm going to do that uh, using a signal counter. Let's grab a screwdriver. So this works like this. So that flip uh, switch lever, <coughs> sorry, controls this toggle latch, which controls this uh, timer, and the timer controls uh, where's the block breaker? Controls a counter. No, that's not counter. That's the one, and. When the counter hits this uh, maximum count, it will uh, turn on this output, which I'm going to use to uh, reset the uh, counter from there, the minus side, it's going to do this decrement. And also we need to uh, flip this lever over, so we can do the, that like uh, like this. Let's stop it and we need to place some cover strips so that the, the these don't uh, connect incorrectly. Okay, so I'm going to show you this is the signal that we are going to use. And it works like this. The counter counts to the 10 and sends signal to here and this flips and the uh, timer stops. Okay, and that's the one that going is going to control the deployer. So let's take this one, cut the wire, and uh, do we need to go? Yeah, we probably. It's better if we go underneath and uh, then to the block breaker. Okay, so if we test it, it should break that bottom block and it did and if I um, let's turn that off and uh, place it back uh, like that and uh, that back okay so that's uh, now ready now we need to get the rest of the tree down so that the block breaker can it can do its uh, stuff and that that's where we are going to use this this uh, piston and this deployer. So <coughs> I'm going to place this uh, deployer here and then the uh, uh, is it? It's probably in there. The piston here, point pointing down. And then we can wire the uh, uh, make the wiring. So I need to go one up like that. Uh, let's grab this one. <coughs> we need to make another one of these. Uh, not like that that and stop. So another signal counter 
up here. That's going to control the uh, the deployer and the piston on the top of the tree. So let's make that. I'm going to do that. Oh, no, I'm going to can't place it there because of the strip. Let's go here instead. And uh, <coughs> then the timer. Like that. Uh, not like that, but like that. And then the uh, wire and the counter at the end and uh, then I'm going to need that screwdriver to flip that over and let's place it to 10 also uh, at least for now and wire the uh, uh, wire the uh, reset like that and then we can use get rid of that now we can use this to uh, uh, yeah it's glitching yeah yeah so the uh, the, the wire was glitching and uh, <laughs> I thought that I had make a mistake here so now we can use this to control the deployer here and the piston here so I'm going to need to wire this piston through a repeater with one de tick delay and uh, I'm going to do that from here like that and then the, the uh, repeater and then we are going to <coughs> need to add some sand in here so let's grab some sand like that and throw that in the deployer. So the uh, deployer deploys the sand here and the piston pushes push it one down and the uh, plug breaker can then break the plug that, that's in here. And then we need to uh, transport the uh, sand back to the deployer. And let's do that next. So we are going to need some pneumatic tubes like that. And uh, I'm going to place a chest here so we can let's get rid of that so we can control uh, that the locks don't make it up make it up to the uh, deployer and we are going to use a filter to control that let's place it um, maybe on the back side so we can open it and then let's pipe this up in here uh, in there and this way So we can we leave mu as much uh, room for the uh, tree to grow as possible, so it doesn't take, or also it does take only one uh, bone meal per tree. And let's set this filter and it, a timer to it. So now it gets the. Uh, transfers the sand back up there and we also need to somehow get this signal into this piston and uh, there's a uh, really cool these uh, panels work really great this com comes with the red, uh, red power tube so if I place a cover here and that's now it's like a block so I can place the red stone wire in there. That's, these are really handy in, in situations like these and the strip strips also when you try to do stuff in a uh, small space. Okay, so these two should be pretty much 
uh, complete. We can test it. I can't remember what the uh, correct uh, settings for the counters were. were. And uh, let's place the wood back in there. I'm going to cut this for now since there is a tree already. And we can see what happens with the uh, rest of the machine. So let's pl flip that switch. Okay, the sand comes down. Okay, so this uh, block breaker needs to uh, go off much, much more often. Uh, or, or more, so that's 15 isn't enough. But this 10 is probably too much. So let's try 7 in there. In the uh, top uh, counter, and this is 15 now. So let's try it again. And you need to wait until this leaves DK. So if you set it to a timer, time needs. Oh, this this uh, lever. If you set this to a timer, you need to set it so long that the uh, leaves get decayed and disappears. So let's try the whole machine. And sometimes it does that, the uh, bone mill doesn't work and I don't know what the uh, reason for it is. It's probably because the... Uh, because the... Uh, uh, these are so close to each other and th that uh, that portion is so so close to it. So let's try again. Okay, now the tree has grown. Let's see what happens. The sand does it. Yeah. Okay, and there's a couple more extra, but that's okay. And let's check the chest. So there's a sapling, which was the previous one, and this sand goes back to the this deployer. Okay. So that's that. Uh, this works. This machine works uh, with this setup. It does work with the. Uh, uh, is this the? Uh, I'm going to have to try with the uh, the uh, the oak wood and the uh, what's the what's the uh, the light wood I don't remember the name of it this one what's this called <laughs> it's wood in here but what's it what's the real name the light wood what what's well you get the idea uh, if you need or want to use this on another one of these uh, for the spruce wood for example you need to lift this up uh, it was probably one or two uh, steps uh, or blocks I can't remember uh, and for the uh, rubber trees which are these guys you need to lift this up a couple of more also so let's this is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and eleven so you need to maybe four blocks up this uh, but uh, I'm not going to do that now oh yeah and I, I almost forgot you need some transposers also let's grab those and uh, let's place these kind of all over this place so that the uh, when the uh, mm, saplings drop these guys will pick them up and uh, I'm going to wa pipe them quickly so let's get those going and this is the deployer for the sapling so let's go there like 
that and uh, these guys also. And let's cover out our uh, the sandstone there. Cover our mess like that and like that. And here too. Now in here we need a a it's not a strip. What's it called? A panel. In there and then the wire. So this wire uh, controls this transposer. This one controls this and this one controls this and I need to wire that. So let's get rid of these and throw in there and the panel to the top like that. Okay and let's get rid of that throw in the uh, oak wood. Uh, what's that the oak? Yeah. Yeah, that's too much. Twelve buck probably is enough. Hmm. It's not deploying the uh, Okay, so something's wrong. Okay, that was stuck somehow. Oh, I flipped the switch too early. That's the reason. But why isn't the tree growing? Is, isn't this the oak one? Hmm. That's really odd. I have to check that whether the uh, bone meal deployer is activating or not. Yeah, I can't see it. It's, uh, yeah, it, it's open. But, uh. Hmm. This is really. <laughs> really strange. Okay, now it worked. So there's uh, some problems with this, but uh, it, it works on, on most of the uh, occasions. Uh, you can't really f pick this up more because if if the uh, tree has more, especially the oak tree, if it, it, if it has more uh, room, it will grow those uh, branches or yeah branches so uh, and that uh, th then the machine won't f break everything so uh, yeah that was too long the shor short the amount so 13 is probably the correct one okay let's get rid of these and try one more time Now there's a one sapling in there. Oh, I prob probably picked it up. Yeah. Yeah, that's the correct height. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. and the se seven is the uh, correct height. But I don't know. It worked fine before, and it, it works. Sometimes now, but uh, <coughs> if you can find a way to uh, improve this, uh, leave me a uh, comment, and uh, I'll try to fix it. But uh, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you on the uh, next episode.